Hello everybody, welcome to a new tutorial. And uh, I know I have been making a bit too much tutorials lately, but I really like making these. And besides that, there's a lot of new apps and stuff I really want to show you guys that you can try it on your Android device. And this cool feature is the Galaxy S7 always on display for any Android device. Now I'm currently running this on my Xperia Z2, running Marshmallow. I'll leave a link to that uh, into the description. And also the app, I'll, I'll leave a link to the app also in the description, like the link of it. So what you want to do is download and install it. After downloading and installing it, open it. Now you will get this uh, thing where you can just enable and disable it. When you enable it for the first time, I'll probably ask you to do a few notification setting changes. But after you've do, done that, uh, I'm going to go and clock. This is are my recommended uh, settings. You want to change everything to that. Go back. Disable the date with this thing, because the date is a bit in the way. Notifications, turn that off as well, but if you if you want your notifications, you can always turn it on, but I necessarily don't need it since I only double tap on my screen to see what's on. So yeah. Oh, that. And... Change everything to that. That's my recommended setting. Now, uh, and also the brightness have to be low as possible because if it's more than zero, it really drains your battery, so yeah, you wanna you wanna put that on too. Now, uh, so uh, when you lock your device, it's supposed to come up like this. So uh, yeah, it, it's it's pretty cool. I mean, let, let's try it for that. Okay, guys, I'm back. Sorry, my uh, screen recorder disabled, but it's working extremely well. When I locked the device, it automatically just came up. And the, there was a black background and everything was working perfectly. I could double tap to unlock it and everything. And it looked pretty well as the uh, clock also moved its position just like the Galaxy S7. But uh, if you don't want the Galaxy S7 style clock, you can also have a digital style clock like this. Or a uh, Gear S2 type of, yeah, like that. But personally, I like the Galaxy 7 clock because it just looks pretty modern and pretty awesome. Anything I would like? Uh, well, something you can add your own widgets or your own clock widget would be pretty awesome in the next update, maybe. Uh, but yeah, guys, that was pretty much how to get um, always on clock on your phone, like the Galaxy 7 and LG G5. If you like this video, be sure to leave a like, comment if you have any questions on anything and yeah, see ya.